Often you feel stuck in your daily life, doing the same thing over and over again, not feeling fulfilled or like you're moving forward. Maybe it's the same job you've been in for years, seeing the same people, doing the same tasks, sitting in the same chair at the same desk, leaving you feeling unfulfilled, bored and unchallenged with the job at hand. You want to see new people, have new experiences, generally live a different life, yet something's holding you back. This video is going to show you why it is that you feel stuck and at the end of this video I'm going to share with you my practical steps in order to free up your life. Hi, my name is Philip and my channel Therapy in London is here to help you to become a better prepared, happier, more confident version of yourself. Remember to subscribe to see weekly videos showing you how you can be the person that you've always wanted to be. And if you feel you've learned something from this video, please do remember to give it a thumbs up. So, feeling stuck is something that many of my clients come to me feeling that they need help with. They tell me that they're bored with their job, their hobbies, their friends, and they want a new challenge in their life. A fresh start, but don't know how to begin to make that change. So first, let's address why it is that you feel it's hard to make that change. Well, fear plays a big part. It's easy and comfortable to do what you've always done. The same job, meet up with the same friends, do the same hobbies, same things on a daily basis. To break away from that monotony would mean a whole new way in relating to others and indeed yourself. Maybe you're asking yourself in this very moment, am I up to the task? Can I really do this? So then, a part of you likes being bored because it's safe. You know how to do the task, it's not taxing. It's just like a bad habit you wanna break. You don't wanna do it anymore, but the thought of not having it in your life seems scary. So, you're not changing as a safety behavior. It's relieving you from not feeling tense and out of control in a new situation. But the consequence of feeling that safety is boredom and angst, whilst feeling stifled in life. Maybe leave a comment down below sharing with me what it is that that safety behavior is stopping you from trying. So, how do we start to break away from that safety behavior? Step number one is to know what you want. Okay, you might wanna be rich, but is that the end of the dream? How are you gonna get rich? What job are you gonna have? What's the process to get that job? What does the job entail? How many interviews do you need to go for? How many CVs do you need to hand out? What are the steps in order to get qualified enough to do that job? Not knowing the answers to all those questions, and many more I'm sure there are, is okay. But not knowing makes you feel scared to try and to even begin to work it out because there's so much that you need to know. But let's try and work it out. Have a clear plan of what you're gonna do and how you're gonna get there. I've spoken about how to make plans in previous videos. You need a plan showing you the route to get to your end goal. All the different paths, all the different tasks. So it's laid out in front of you. The reason change might seem so scary is because you've got no clear path to get to that end goal, to get to your dream. So now you're gonna draw up this map. The next step is to start setting realistic goals for yourself. It's not just enough to know what you want and have a plan of how to get there. You need to schedule time and set yourself goals so you know what you're gonna do, when you're gonna do it, and when you'd have finished that task so you can tick it off and go on to the next one. You might be tempted to try to do everything all at once and get everything done as soon as possible. If you try and do everything at the same time, you're gonna feel tired, stressed, and overwhelmed. You're not gonna to wanna to finish the task at hand. You're never gonna to get to your end goal. But make it achievable, make it fun, and set time for breaks too. So now you've got your plan, and you've got some time scales of when you're gonna actually go and do those things, the next step is to go out and do it. The sort of change that you want is not gonna happen overnight, but by making a change, no matter how small, it's gonna have a dramatic impact in the way that others see you, and most importantly, the way you see yourself. It's gonna show you that you have what it takes to get to where you wanna get to. Those small steps add up, and the more small steps you do, the more you're gonna achieve. The more you achieve, the more you're gonna feel able to handle and manage. And soon enough, you'll actually want to do the work as you're enjoying doing it and it's getting closer to your dreams. It won't seem so daunting and also it won't actually seem like work anymore because you'll have fun doing it. The last step is to enjoy the ride. If you made it this far into this video, it must be something that you really wanna do. Make sure you enjoy the tasks that it takes to make it to your end goal, to make it to reach your dreams, because otherwise you're never gonna stick at it. What these tasks are doing is confronting the fear and changing that fear into excitement. Rather than taking on everything all at once, it's starting you to see things in a smaller way. Do a task at a time to make it manageable, to make it fun. By having a plan and using it to set yourself realistic goals, it's gonna allow you to feel like you're moving forward or helping you to change your life so you don't have that stuck feeling. You feel that you're living the life you want to live. Remember, you can use these steps to achieve any dream that you want to achieve, 
any task, any goal. So start your journey right now. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's helped you to see that you have what it takes to break free from feeling stuck. It might seem like a lot of work, but trust me, if you keep at it, it's gonna be worth it. Remember, if you enjoyed this video, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna see weekly videos showing you how you can be happier, more confident, and better in control of your life, please do remember to subscribe. All the best, I look forward to seeing you next week. Take care, bye-bye.